New York Yankees fans, how's it going? It is Felix from NYNews.com. Like always, hola, como estas? Hey, Yankees fans, if you are sensitive, this is one of those videos that if you are, I would X out right now. But if you're not, but if you are, if you're not, you can handle it. Then listen here. JT Riamuto. People pronounce his name JT Riamato. Let's just call him JT Tomato. <laughs> no, I'm just joking. Nothing against you, challenges. I love you, challenges. But I do get comments saying, hey, Felix, you're saying his name wrong, whatever. Whatever, I am Dominican, all right? Just uh, cu cut me some slack. It's better than all these other analysis like uh, Pedro Martinez. And hey, nothing against him either. So, um, yeah, the Yankees, there's been quite some talk, I'll say, within the last uh, four months about uh, the Yankees potentially acquiring JT Ramuto. You know, if you pay attention to NYNews.com, this channel, I was really the first one to suggest a trade like that and it's picked up some steam i'll say it's picked up a lot of steam john Heyman has reported on a trade like that and now joe sherman of the ny post has suggested a trade or not even suggested it's being said that the yankees are really interested in acquiring and training for riamutu this offseason why because gary sanchez they think that gary sanchez is not going to improve defensively behind the plate so before the Gary Sanchez hardcore fans get mad out there, if the Yankees trade for Riamuto, in my honest opinion, Gary's not going anywhere. If the Yankees trade for Riamuto, and it can happen, Jeter and the Yankees have an excellent relationship. The Yankees like Riamuto. The Yankees don't see Gary Sanchez as a long-term catcher. It would be for a package that includes prospects and not a package that has Gary Sanchez in it. So what does this mean? This means that the Yankees are looking at Gary Sanchez and being their long-term DH and platoon guy when it comes to, let's say, first base or catcher. So who's the old man out? Again, I'm going to trigger a lot of folks, but before I say this, I am a John Carlos Stanton guy. I prefer Stanton over Gary any day. But the old man out, if the Yankees do acquire a real Mutu, not saying it's going to happen, but if they do, that means that uh, John Carlos Stanton is the old man out for many reasons. John Carlos Stanton is about to make, what, 26 30 to $35 million per year. Gary Sanchez, as of now, makes about six hundred k and is about to increase when he hears his arbitration case. But it's still going to be way cheaper than Stanton. Also. The Dodgers have a love fascination with John Carlos Stanton, and John Carlos Stanton likes the Dodgers. So, before people get mad, I'm not saying this is going to happen, but let's say the Yankees do trade for Riamutu. The old man out is Stanton, and like I said, for many reasons. We all know now, when it comes to the Yankees and money, the Yankees prefer to save money. They prefer to stay under the luxury tax. They prefer... A deal, a deal that makes sense for the Yankees. So let's put ourselves into how Steinbrenner's head. Let's put ourselves into Cashman's head. Let's put ourselves into a high-ranking Yankees official. What makes more sense? Paying a player 600 k and it's going to raise to a couple of millions of dollars, like I said, once uh, Gary Sanchez has his uh, arbitration case. But what makes more sense? Paying, let's say, 600 k to two or five million dollars per year for a dh or 26 to 30 to 36 million dollars per year for a dh i mean see what i'm saying here folks i mean if the yankees trade for a real mutu it's obvious a player like stanton is the old man out i mean that position at dh is occupied you got a guy barely making any money that can really if he has a good year put the same numbers as a stanton up I mean, Gary Sanchez, well-rested, just being a DH, he'll be a beast, in my opinion. And this is coming from me. You guys know I'm a huge uh, John Carlos Stanton fan. I've defended Stanton. I defended Stanton when Yankees fans booed him. I like Stanton. I've never said anything negative about Stanton. But I've said numerous negative things about Gary Sanchez. So com this coming from me, if the Yankees trade for a real Mutu, I'm sorry to say John Carlos Stanton is the old man out. The Dodgers love Stanton. Stanton loves the Dodgers. I mean, if this scenario takes place, the Yankees acquire Real Mutu, you, I, I could see Stanton being traded to the Dodgers. I could see 
the Yankees unloading that contract. And if anything positive comes out from a trade like that, the Yankees have enough money to go after Machado or Harper. And you still have premier players like Riamuto and Gary Sanchez on your team. So, Yankees fans, leave your opinions in the comment section below. If you are following Yankees news, you know that JT Riamuto to the Yankees is a hot topic. A whole bunch of reporters are reporting on it. Leave your opinions in the comment section below. If the Yankees acquire JT, who is the old man? Now, obviously, we can't keep all these players, folks. I'm sorry. And I'm sorry if I come off as a John Carlos Stanton hater. I know people are going to say, oh, you're just reporting on this to get clicks. No, I have been talking about this for months now. Now it's gaining traction, steam. And I'm not saying it's going to happen, folks. But if it does, I'm just saying we have to analyze what the Yankees are going to do. Also, it is my opinion that John Carlos Stanton needs to finish the season strong. He has had the perfect opportunity to carry the Yankees with Judge being out. He's been so-so. Hey, it's just my opinion. If the Yankees are going to pay John Carlos Stanton all this money, and they have a guy like Gary Sanchez who could easily DH, I mean, really, it just makes sense if the Yankees acquire Riamutu that somebody by the name of John Carlos Stanton is the old man out. Riamutu, Riamoto, Riamutu, Riamoto however you want to pronounce it. So Yankees fans, leave your opinions in the comment section below. I hope this is not the case. I like Stanton, but really the Yankees need to make a move when it comes to having a legit catcher behind the plate that's controllable. And realistically, JT is one of the best catchers in Major League Baseball or the best catcher in Major League Baseball. And for the people that think Gary Sanchez is going to be traded for Riamutu, I mean, why would the Marlins trade for Gary Sanchez if Riamutu is superior as a defensive catcher to Gary Sanchez. Gary Sanchez as a catcher is subpar, or maybe one of the worst. So that makes absolutely zero sense. So if you acquire JT, it be for prospects. So Yankees fans, leave your opinions in the comment section below. This has been Felix from NYNews.com. Share, like, and subscribe, and I will check you on next.